This video is about displaying which Git branch I'm on within the command prompt of Unix. To make this happen, I need to put this function within the ps1 variable. And I did that in my .bashrc file. So let me show you my bashrc file. Okay, I'm in my, my home directory. I'm opening nano on the bashrc file. This is the line where I actually modify the ps1 variable. This part over here shows my host, which is the iMac. This, par this part over here is the part that I've added so that the get branch will appear in the prompt. This is a function right here. And this function is defined in in a shell script. And that's the one that's being run right over here. Okay, the script right now is called dot get, uh, let's see, hyphen prompt dot sh. You see it right there. Okay. Now, it, this is important. It took some doing for me to get this script to come over here. I'll basically, okay, the place where I got it from, because I have Xcode installed, I went and researched on the internet and I found out that I can use, okay, there is a, this script somewhere on my Mac system. So what I did is I went and got it from this place on my Mac and I copied it to my user directory. Then I used the MV command, move command, to rename it to put a dot in front of it. And then I went ahead and put in these lines over here. I you know not that I'm a smart bash coder or anything. I just copied, you know, I did whatever was being done here for the dot git completion.bash file. That way, my bash RC will load that script. That way, when this function, git ps1, is called, it'll be a defined function and be able to execute that function. So that's how I got my prompt to work. All right, let me exit here, control X. Now, I want to show you what that new value for PS1 does. Now, notice here, my prompt hasn't changed. Although the PS1 has been changed. The reason for that is I'm in a directory that's not part of a Git repository. If I switch over to my project, which is, a, you know, uses Git. Okay, I'm going to do that. All right, voila, look what happened. Now it is showing me which branch I'm on. I'm on the master branch. What did I want to do? Yeah, get branch. Okay, I am on the master and it shows. Okay, so let's say I do get checkout uh, shorten title. Okay, so I checked, I switched branches. Well, look at that. It's telling me I'm on the branch called shorten title. Okay, I showed you already how I redefined my PS1 prompt in my bash RC file. And I showed you that there is a script that has to be loaded and how I got it. Let me show you the script again. Okay, first, I have to go to my home directory. 
and then I show you which files are there you will see there's this is the file that I sourced in my bash RC this one up here is the one that allows me to do tab completion in Git. So one is for tab completion in Git, and one is for providing that function which allows me to see which branch I'm in and be able to see it within the Unix command prompt.